Welcome to the podcast, Koala Reading AI. I am your host and the voice behind the text-to-speech model. Get ready for an exciting journey through the world of computer vision. In today's episode, we have fascinating papers to discuss. Let's begin with a brief overview of each one. Paper 1. Face, Klipnareff text-driven 3D face manipulation using deformable neural radiance fields. The paper presents a method for text-driven facial manipulation that can control local facial deformations with simple changes in words and successfully reflects emotional expressions and descriptive sentences, outperforming other baselines in visual quality and target text attribute reflection. Paper 2. Patch and Pack, Navi T a vision transformer for any aspect ratio and resolution. The paper presents NAVIT, a vision transformer that uses sequence packing for processing diverse input resolutions, leading to improved training efficiency, enhanced performance on image and video classification, object detection, semantic segmentation, and better results on robustness and fairness benchmarks. Paper 3. Dream Teacher, pre-training image backbones with deep generative models. The paper introduces Dream Teacher, a self-supervised learning framework that uses generative networks for pre-training image backbones, outperforming existing methods on multiple generative models and benchmarks without requiring manual annotation. Now that we have an overview of these exciting papers, let's take a deep dive into each one. We'll explore the abstract methodology and key results of each paper. Paper 1. Face Clip Nerf. Text Driven 3. D. Face Manipulation Using Deformable. Abstract. The paper presents a novel approach for text-driven manipulation of 3D facial models using a combination of natural language processing and neural rendering techniques. The proposed method utilizes a pre-trained language model, CLIP, to embed textual descriptions of desired facial attributes into a high-dimensional space. This embedding is then used to condition a neural rendering framework, NIRF, to generate 3D facial models that reflect the desired attributes. The method is evaluated on a data set of facial images and textual descriptions and is shown to outperform several baseline methods in terms of both visual quality and fidelity to the target attributes. Method. The proposed method consists of two main components, a text embedding module and a neural rendering module. The text embedding module utilizes the CLIP language model to embed textual descriptions of desired facial attributes into a high-dimensional space. This embedding is then used to condition the neural rendering module, which is based on the NeurF architecture. The neural rendering module generates 3D facial models that reflect the desired attributes by optimizing a set of learned parameters to minimize the difference between the rendered image and the target image. To train the model, the authors collected a data set of facial images and textual descriptions of desired attributes, such as smiling or crying. The text embeddings were computed using the CLIP model, and the neural rendering module was trained to generate 3D facial models that reflect the desired attributes. The authors also conducted several experiments to evaluate the performance of the proposed method, including a comparison with several baseline methods. Results. The proposed method is shown to outperform several baseline methods in terms of both visual quality and fidelity to the target attributes. The authors report qualitative manipulation results of their method driven with a set of descriptive sentences, showing that the method not only faithfully reflects the descriptions, but also can easily control local facial deformations with simple changes in the input text. The authors also report manipulated results driven by emotional expression texts, showing that the method can successfully manipulate facial expressions even if the emotional texts are implicit representations of many local facial deformations. Overall, the proposed method represents a significant advance in the field of text-driven manipulation of 3D facial models. By combining natural language processing and neural rendering techniques, the method enables users to easily generate 3D facial models that reflect desired attributes 
such as emotional expressions or facial deformations. The method has potential applications in fields such as computer graphics, virtual reality, and facial animation. Paper 2. Patch and Pack, Navi T, a Vision Transformer. Abstract. The paper introduces a novel approach to pre-training vision transformers using a method that is both efficient and scalable. The authors propose a new architecture, NaviT, which is a result of a neural architecture search, NAS, specifically designed for vision transformers, VIT. The NAS is trained using a new token dropping regularization method, which is resolution agnostic and allows the model to generalize across a wide range of input resolutions. The authors also introduce a new training strategy that involves training on a range of resolutions and then fine tuning on a specific target resolution. Method. The authors employ a neural architecture search, NAS, to find an optimal architecture for vision transformers, VT. The NAS is designed to be resolution agnostic, meaning it can handle inputs of varying resolutions. The authors also introduce a new regularization method called token dropping. This method randomly drops tokens from the input sequence during training, which encourages the model to learn more robust representations. The authors also propose a new training strategy where the model is initially trained on a range of resolutions and then fine-tuned on a specific target resolution. This approach is designed to make the model more flexible and adaptable to different input resolutions. Results. The authors present extensive results demonstrating the effectiveness of their proposed methods. They show that Navity models outperform their VIT counterparts across a range of resolutions. The authors also provide a detailed comparison of the training details of VEE and NaviT with supervised classification, showing the efficiency of their proposed methods. Furthermore, they present results from various experiments to measure model quality for given runtime cost showing that the model retains most of the quality down to 40% of the image size. In terms of use cases, the paper shows that NaviT can be effectively used in scenarios where the input resolution can vary, such as in medical imaging where images can come from different sources and have different resolutions. The authors also demonstrate the model's performance on model versus human datasets across different fine-tuning resolutions showing that a single NaviT model trained on varying resolutions performs roughly on par with fine-tuning one NaviT model per test resolution. The innovation of this paper lies in the introduction of a new architecture and training strategy for vision transformers that is both efficient and scalable. The proposed methods allow the model to handle inputs of varying resolutions, making it more flexible and adaptable to different use cases. The authors also introduce a new regularization method, token dropping, which helps the model learn more robust representations. The paper shows that NaviT consistently surpasses VAT in performance while using the same computational budget across different compute and parameter scales. For example, the performance of the top performing VIT can be matched by a NaviT model with only 50% of the parameters. The paper also shows that NaviT outperforms VIT on zero-shot ImageNet classification and COCO image text retrieval. The paper provides examples of use cases for NaviT, such as image captioning and visual question answering, where NaviT achieves state-of-the-art performance. The paper concludes that NaviT is a promising approach to pre-training vision transformers that improves both training efficiency and performance. Paper 3. Dream Teacher pre-training image backbones with deep generative models. Abstract? The paper presents a novel approach to pre-training image backbones using deep generative models. The authors propose a method called Dream Teacher, which leverages the power of generative models to create a diverse set of training examples. The idea is to use these generated samples to pre-train the backbone of an image classifier. This approach is motivated by the fact that generative models have the ability to capture the data distribution and can generate a wide variety of samples, thus providing a rich set of training examples for the backbone. Method. The dream teacher method involves two main steps. 
The first step is to train a deep generative model on a large data set. The authors used a GAN, Generative Adversarial Network, for this purpose. The GAN is trained to generate images that are indistinguishable from the real images in the data set. The second step is to use the trained GAN to generate a set of images. These images are then used to pre-train the backbone of an image classifier. The authors argue that this approach provides a more diverse set of training examples compared to traditional methods. The backbone is then fine-tuned on a downstream task. The authors also introduce a new technique called contrastive learning with hallucinated queries to further improve the performance of the backbone. This technique involves generating a set of hallucinated images from the GAN and using them as queries in a contrastive learning framework. This approach is designed to encourage the backbone to learn more robust and discriminative features. Results. The results section of the paper presents a series of experiments to evaluate the effectiveness of the dream teacher method. The authors compare the performance of their method with other pre-training methods on several benchmark datasets, including ImageNet and Cypher10. The results show that the Dream Teacher method outperforms other pre-training methods in terms of classification accuracy. For instance, on the ImageNet dataset, the Dream Teacher method achieved a top one accuracy of 79.3%, which is higher than the accuracy achieved by other methods. The authors also present several use cases to demonstrate the practical applications of their method. For example, they show that the dream teacher method can be used to improve the performance of object detection and semantic segmentation tasks. In these tasks, the pre-trained backbone is used as a feature extractor and the features are then used to train a task-specific model. The authors argue that the dream teacher method represents a significant innovation in the field of image classification. By leveraging the power of generative models, the method provides a more diverse set of training examples for the backbone, leading to improved performance on downstream tasks. Furthermore, the introduction of the contrastive learning with hallucinated queries technique provides a new way to enhance the robustness and discriminability of the features learned by the backbone. Thank you for listening to Koala Reading AI. Hope you had fun.